Greetings, beloved, in the wonderful name of our Lord, Savior, Jesus Christ. You welcome to this channel. I am Sakile. So God today is saying you were almost exposed to danger. Beloved, it's been, um, it's been quite some time having dreams about people who are actually dying. And I remember in year 2020, when my brother was about to, to die, it happened that I had dreams. I remember one of the dreams, which was a final dream. I dreamt him actually in the pulpit going to accept Jesus. And after accepting Jesus, he drove into a truck and he took a truck which was outside that church and drove away. And I jumped in, followed the truck. And only that he was going to drive into a certain into a certain valley which was very dangerous hallelujah and when he was driving i was able to hold the stay well but when i woke up from that dream i realized there is something wrong and i prayed when i prayed to god my mom called and he said to me i just dreamt of your brother and they were shooting they were shooting him with a gun please find out if if he is safe and when i went to his place i found out that he is safe he is fine, hallelujah. And after I have prayed, I believed that God had healed him in whatever spirit that was sneaking in, in, in his life. And later, two weeks after we have been dreaming about this, two weeks after we have been dreaming, we received the news that our brother is no more. Hallelujah. So God today is saying there is someone who is actually exposed to danger. There is someone who's almost exposed to danger. And God is saying today, I must pray for you. You also need to know that this message is for you and you need to pray. The Bible says when Esther had the challenge, he decided to start by fasting for three days and pray for the heart of and pray that the and pray that the heart of the king is at ease. Hallelujah. God is say, so God today is saying, as you are exposed to danger, as you are almost exposed to death, God is saying, pray and fast for three days and ask that God's heart is at ease so that your life is extended. Let us pray. Father, I release your blood, mighty Father. May he or she find mercy upon you, Lord. May she find grace, my God. Lord, moreover, I pray that this message reaches the owner. I pray, mighty Father, that this message reaches the owner, mighty Father, so she may be able, so he may be able to take the fasting, so we may be able, my Father, to speak to you, to connect to you. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I release the blood of the living God upon everyone who's hesitant and doubtful, my Father. I pray that you be an eye open in their heart. I pray that your spirit moves and hooves in their heart, my God. In the mighty name of Jesus Christ, I pray. Amen. Stay blessed and continue to watch the channel. Amen.